The final few weeks of the Hockey East regular season are upon us, and points are coming at more of a premium with each passing game. Maine comes to Matthews Arena, fresh off a win across town last night, while Northeastern settled for two points and a tie with UConn. It's Black Bears and Huskies for the final time this season, and it's next here on ESPN. Final half minute of the penalty. Constantinople from the circle back up to the point area. Carter, one-timer from Constantinople, rebound, it's tapped home by Knoll. Katie Knoll on the rebound, and it's 1-0 Huskies on the power play. Easiest goal Katie is going to score all year. It starts with a big howitzer of a slap shot by Constantinople. And I said on the open, Northeastern is going to have to get greedy. They're going to have to dig away in front of the net. That's exactly what Peyton Anderson does. And Noel says, thank you very much. I'll clean that up, and I'll take the loose change for my fifth in the last five games. And she has been Six so games. good of recent, Ben. And that's just another example. Grinder does the same. Now Irving. Irving looking for some options. Two defenders there with her up against the wall. Now Irving splits through to the circle area shot. It's tipped up in the air and in. Skyler Irving sent it in. And I'm pretty sure it was redirected home by Jules Constantinople. Although now Irving's going to skate out in front of the line. I think, let's take a look at the replay here. I think this is going to be Irving's goal. It goes off of the main skater and floats yeah. over Bacchetti's right shoulder, I believe. And if it's going to be Irving's goal, as I think it is, that bodes quite well as Skyler continues her career year. That's her eighth. eighth. Shop at it cleanly because Northeastern is right there. We talk about the all the new faces and transfers into the program as well. A shot and a score. It's Irving again. Her second of the game. And the Huskies lead 3-0. Well, if there was any doubt about her first, there is none about her second. Snipe top twine. And there's there's one place this puck is going when it gets on her plate, and it's from almost the same spot. I said in the first period, Maine was giving up the slot far too easily, and Irving takes advantage, and we're going to see a change in goaltender. McKetty out, Jordan Madison in for so six on five now, two minutes remaining. Kokovec blocked there by Carter. Carter's bid this time is good. The empty net goal, first of the season for the captain. And it's 4 0 Huskies. Well, her first bid at it trickled just wide, and she's got the most sheepish grin that you're ever going to see. I don't know that that's how she drew up getting her first of the year. But it all counts in the box score, just the same fluttering on edge and nestling into the back of the net. And Northeastern is going to take all three, barring something completely on the goal of her fifth season. A big win for the Huskies. They now tie for second place with Boston College ahead of a huge two-game weekend with the Eagles next week. For our entire crew, including my broadcast partners, Ben Horner and Craig White, my name is John Amino, saying so long once again. The final score from Boston, Northeastern 4, Maine nothing. This has been a presentation of Hockey East on ESPN.